coming. It's always amazing getting the handle on the heat on this porch because it's up to 98, 96, 98, and it's always quite a few degrees hotter than what's outside the <laughs> weather. But with the umbrella, it, it helped a lot. Since it lets some of the sun through, it helps the plants, but boy, it sure still winds up being hot, which is really amazing. But other parts of the country, they say, are even hotter, so praise the Lord. In God Calling, the way of praise. I am reading to you both my way of removing mountains. The way to remove mountains is the way of praise. When a trouble comes, think of all you have to be thankful for and praise. Say thank you all the time. This is the remover of mountains. Your thankful hearts of praise. Sometimes, you know, some of these <laughs> are a little bit of fluff. But sometimes you need a little fluff in order to go with your stuff because most people are carrying way too much stuff and they need some fluff in order to kind of counterbalance, make them able to carry all that extra weight that they're carrying anyways. But you know, God never intended for us to always be beating each other up or bummed out, blown out, or fried out. But sometimes he just wants to hear, you know, the childlike response that children that are given a candy bar or a little piece of gumdrop or something that um, they take joy in, get all excited and wound up and go, yeah, thank you, thank you. And that's what God delights in us when we praise him for what he's given us. But he wants us to go beyond just simply praising him for the good things that we think of as good, but he wants us to give praise and thanks in all things. Because you see, in heaven, there is a continuation of praise going on 24-7. It never ends. There is a constant music, you could say, or quality of that dimension, the spiritual dimension, that heaven is, that the highest heaven exists in, that there is a constant praise being said of God and that it always is being manifested by spiritual beings that are there that claim and exclaim, Holy, 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 Lord God Almighty, was and is and is to come. But that declare constantly who He is and what He is. and It's a magnificent... difference than the world we live in because we hear sound here but sound is physical there and so in reality when when we approach heaven we'll find that there is certain qualities to it that don't translate too well coming into our world but the bottom line is when you praise <laughs> you will give God something that he wants and desires from us and that's what we were created to do is to give him praise and to glorify his name and to enjoy who he is as he enjoys the fact that he created us and wants to walk or have fellowship with us and so don't always get too serious sometimes just keep it simple don't get too carried away about the emotional part but just keep it simple like a simple praise the lord and you'll put a smile on god's face do it the easy way. It's a lot better than the hard.